What is going on, everyone? Welcome back to another episode of Lemur's Corner. I am Eagle, and today is a uh, update or introduction to my side on Ark. Um, I decided to go ahead and grind out a few things before I uh, before I decided to put a video out, just so. Uh, we're not starting really from basic and you'll have to watch me catch up the whole time so just been putting in a few uh, few hours of grinding so we have so we have some stuff uh, we got some dinos that were given to us so um, today we're going to be building our actual big main base and this is where we're gonna be building it um, so on this side of the, of the river, I want our big main, uh, crafting base with maybe our ground, a few of our ground dinos. And then I want to build a bridge going across this river up to there. And I think in the middle of the bridge will be our uh, flyers, so our bird dinos, Quetzals, Argies, and Pteranodons. And then I haven't really figured out what I want the other side to be. But ultimately, the goal is to uh, have a behemoth gate fence, or yeah, behemoth gate fence going around so all this area is protected. Don't have these... Uh, horrible dinos that kill everything in in uh in our base. So I have a kind of a rough sketch of what I want the base to look like. Uh this is what it looks like. It looks horrible. Yes, I know. Um so we're going to start it here and this is going to be the circle towers that are on the side. And then I figure out messed up already. Okay, so we want face this way. Right? Here. Go. So I can make foundations going off of this. So I pretty much have all of them. I hope I have all the materials that I need, but uh, we we will certainly see. Uh, I'm not sure how long I want to make this. I think I think maybe I think that should do give us do one more and then I do the circle There we go. It's a little uneven, but the back, eh. It'll give us a little bit of uh, space to build the bridge. Okay, we'll make those wings on the out. So we'll make those like outside wings. Okay. 
I think I'm gonna make. I think I'm gonna make this part the crafting area, and then I'll make a behemoth gate or something that has or a dino. Gotta be big enough. Gonna have our indie forge. Gonna have our Anki drop in it. I want to do something different, maybe with it with an Anki drop. I want to have at least three forges, so I can uh, so I can start mass smelting. Okay. Perfect. Should hopefully have all the materials we need. So, I'm not going to make y'all watch this. We're going to speed it up, and we'll see y'all on a build update.
We are back. We got our walls, we got our foundations, and we got our ceilings up. Only thing we need to do is uh, zone this in. I think I think I'm gonna wall these, and they're gonna be like no. I don't know if I want them to be. No, we can use them as like crafting areas. So if we do four of these, All right, we will see y'all on a final build update and what the final base looks like. And then I'll also throw in a later update of what the final look layout and look of the base look is with everything that's done. So we'll see y'all then. Uh, last time we saw the base, we just got the first part done. We didn't really do anything on the inside well I've uh, been working uh, non-stop get the base pretty much finished and I think it I think it's done so this is one this is one uh, one part basically done we can now start focusing on uh, breeding Rexes and getting them up for the bosses so I ended up using the, the side pieces that uh, I couldn't really figure out what we were going to use it for. Uh, for storage, bedding, my over there's my uh, generator, and then I have all my snails in here. I uh, got the inside pretty much completely furnished. All the stuff I need. All my storage is right there. And then here's my uh, food crafting. I got my indie forges here. We ended up getting two of them. And then the first the first part I worked on after getting this inside done was the farm. Pretty simple make. It's all this is just greenhouse glass. 
and I just separated each section with the half walls that they they let you get. We got uh, we got signs telling you what they are. There, here's my uh, beehive, and then all you gotta do is just pull the fertilizer and you, and you distribute it, and there you go. And you don't even have to go around collecting it. The next thing I started working on was the bird pen. I only have two two birds, so not uh, not fully yet. But it's going to be big enough to park at least two quetzals. And all up here is going to be birds if I need it. Uh, then we got the door to to the. Uh, the green room or to the uh, greenhouse we have we have this area if we need it and then this is going to be the like breeding raising area I think I'm gonna do like a little like a little a little box right here or something that way I can put a bunch of ACs in and then I'll move them out all right well that's gonna do it on this episode of lemurs corner thanks for tuning in and thanks for being a part of the build process and watching the whole thing uh, if you've made it this far be sure to like and subscribe give us a thumbs up and uh, let us know what you want to see we got the whole island to, to do whatever we want. So we'll see y'all on the next episode of Lemur's Corner.